Hey gang, Daryl Davis coming to here to talk about designing a life worth smiling about. So I want to talk to you about having focus and taking action in your life. I was reading something about uh, baseball, and I'm not, I'm not a, a sports person, so forgive me if I mess this up. But here's what I was d discovered. That a pitcher, when a pitcher pitches a ball at 90 miles an hour, from the mound to the home plate, it's about 60 feet. So when that happens, the studies show that that takes about four-tenths of a second for this to occur once the ball leaves the, the pitcher's hand and crosses the plate. Now, a batter has to start swinging on this pitch when the ball is 30 feet away from where he is. So, in a sense, when you think about this, this batter is reaching into the future to resolve something that has yet to occur in the present. <laughs> this is deep stuff. Now, I started thinking to myself, how does a, this batter do? How does a batter reach into the future to resolve something that has yet to happen in the present? Well, you can say a lot of things, but let's boil it down to two. Focus and, and, commit, and following through taking action on your commitment. Now, when he's there on the plate, that batter has got to really stay focused on the ball. He can't be distracted by what's happening in the, the stadiums and the fans and the screaming and cheering. He can't be thinking about what's happening at home with his wife or his kids. He's got to stay focused. As a matter of fact, I don't know if they do this in, in professional ball, but like if the catcher's egging him on saying, <laughs> no batter, no batter, swing! Or, you know, your mother wears army boots. I'm sure they don't do that in pro, but if they did, that'd be funny. The umpire would be like, come on, guys, grow up. This batter can't be distracted by any of this. He's got to stay focused. That's number one. Number two is once he makes the commitment and starts to take action, he's got to follow through on that action. He can't stop. He can't second-guess himself. He's got he's to stay committed to the commitment that he made once he started. This is life. Number one is whatever you're trying to accomplish in your life, more in your business, number one is you need focus. If you are taking something on that's very important, you need to be focused. You can't be distracted by people in the, in the bleachers talking about what you're doing and commenting and opinionating. You've got to stay focused and let that, don't get hooked by that. The second thing is you've got to take action and be committed to your action. You cannot start something and start to question and pull back. Make the commitment and take action. Don't worry about if it's the right action as long as you're taking action. You know, as a matter of fact, if you don't make the commitment and start taking action, no action is still an action. It's just not action, but it's still something. It's like a batter, when he doesn't swing, he made a choice to not take action. That's still a choice. That ball still strike. He's still got a, a score on his lack of taking action. So take action in your life. Be focused. Follow through. And don't second guess yourself. Keep plugging on. Keep pushing, pushing. Okay. Anyway, I hope this helped you. Have a wonderful day. And don't forget to keep smiling.